right, what's happening everyone? Pragmatic added here, good morning. So uh, I actually just got home from being out of town for a few days and uh, I was saying in my, before I posted my review of Maxine, I was like, yeah, it might be a little bit late as far as like me getting out that new long legs, uh, the birthdaymurders.net video. Well, I was checking like literally 20 minutes ago and still hasn't been updated. So uh, it looks like I caught that in time, but also, as I was uh, pulling in, got a notification for a new Long Legs teaser. Now, this movie does come out in literally, what's today, like the 8th? It comes out in literally like 3 or 4 days. So, I didn't think that we would be getting a final trailer, which we actually got another trailer that was called the final trailer like a few days ago. Didn't react to it because I saw it like several times in the theaters. This one is called um, Heartbreak, or Heartbeat. So, I don't know what to expect with this one. It's a little over a minute. But, uh, yeah, with the uh, website, The Birthday Murders, seemingly wrapping up with the movie about to release, I am super excited to see what we are going to get in this most likely final book. So, let's check out Heartbeat. The first time Micah Monroe saw Nicolas Cage's long legs. Wait, are we seeing long legs? Was in the following scene. <laughs> Oh, look at that. Look at the way it's filmed. What you're about to hear is Micah's actual heartbeat. What an interesting trailer. What an interesting marketing tactic. That is so fucking cool. The fact that this is actually when she first sees him is incredible. Are we gonna see him though? Oh, you sons of bitches. Give me this scene now. Resting heart rate is 76 BPM. In this scene, it hit 170 BPM. When I walked in and saw Nicolas Cage for the first time as long legs, that was visceral. That was a visceral experience I'll never forget. That has to be the final look. Oh my god, and, and I've been hearing some great reviews. I mean, the only reviews I've been hearing are like 5 out of 5, A+, plus, 10 out of 10. That Nick Cage in here is absolutely unrecognizable. He's terrifying. This is something that you'll never get out of your system. So I am really curious to see not just how much they're hyping it up, but to see what the real reveal is. Because uh, the first review I ever saw that of this movie was Dead Meat's review. And he said that uh, it has a great villain, which is Nick Cage's long legs. So I am really curious to see just what he does in this movie. How, obviously how he comes off. How much screen time he gets. As the website now, as we've been going through it. I, I'm just going to say it. Like I was saving this for the review, but I'm just going to say it now. The film almost feels like a sequel at this point. That uh, website almost feels like a prologue or like a prequel. And this feels like a feature length sequel or something. It's really odd, but the, the marketing here is absolutely astonishing. It is overwhelmingly impressive. I absolutely can't wait for this movie, guys. That was an interesting teaser from all the reviews that you could possibly read. They're all saying, yeah, believe the fucking hype. This is something that you've never seen before, and it's something that may never leave your system. It's absolutely best horror film of the year. It's best movie of the year. I can't wait, guys. Couple more days for long legs. But yes, guys, I am back home. That is going to wrap it up for this video. I will be getting into episode 4 of The Birthday Murders very soon here. But as always, guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one very soon. Take care.